This is the tapping noise. This tap most likely coming from ignition timing not right. It could be from also weak compression in one cylinder. Valve clearance has been done. We'll do that again. And it's on idle only. As soon as this goes a little higher, it goes away. doesn't really go away but less prominent so let's see if we can get rid of this so this is it the tapping sound that we thought is coming from valve lash is gone it's not the valve lash so I'll show what's uh, was causing the tapping sound now we adjusted the valve lash and tapping was still there and we did the ignition timing, tapping was still there. So we checked the check engine light, the engine code, and is the detonation knock sensor. As I said, like uh, if that's not there or not working right, then they, that <coughs> engine may tap. Now it runs nice. nice and healthy sound and the um, so what we did is we found that the detonation knock sensor which is at the back of the engine right under the intake manifold right below there was broken I'll uh, try to show the tiny green the green sensor there right above the oil filter Very difficult to show, very difficult to access. That green, uh, little green connector. So that's, uh, it needs a 24 millimeter socket to open it. It's a huge success. And then we plug the ignition timing gun in number one cylinder. Connect the positive, negative. Let the engine warm up. Connect the uh, service port, which is that one, the two pins again. And then you can adjust the ignition timing once the engine is warmed up. Right now it's staying around 14, 15. Right there, it's about 15. And to adjust, you can loosen the distributor bolts, all three, 12 or 13 millimeter, and rotate it left and right. 
As you rotate it, the ignition timing will change. Okay, this uh, hope this helps. Uh, this is a four cylinders, so the detonation knock sensor is at the back under the intake manifold. In the six cylinders, usually it's under the intake manifold. Plenum. The plenum has to come off. Sometimes the lower intake manifold has to come off. And then uh, the detonation knock sensor is right there. Uh, check the other uh, uh, video on uh, from Wise Monkey. Uh, Honda Pilot knock sensor. It will uh, show the location of the detonation knock sensor on a 3.5 liter V6 engine. Hope this helps. This is a huge success. That knock, knocking sound was, it sounded like as if the uh, connecting rod is broken. So it's not the case, it's the detonation knock sensor. Uh, the detonation has to be, had to be right. Amazing difference. The knocking comes and right away it corrects it. The uh, computer corrects it. Okay, please share and subscribe.